Hey everybody, it's Tina Noir. I wanted to do another coloring video. I know it's been a minute since I've done one, uh, mainly because um, over the last little bit, um, I've been addicted to playing video games. Um, I recently had got back on track with uh, my weight loss stuff now that um, I haven't been as in pain as much with my back situation. Um, for those of you who don't follow my updates as far as weight loss, um, last spring and summer I had some issues and it turned out um, I have mild arthritis in my lower spine as well as deteriorating tissue in my lower spine and uh, I had plantar fasciitis in both feet and sciatica and some other crazy stuff going on uh plus i had two cancer scares uh so i had to do physical therapy and some other stuff um thankfully my cancer tests came back okay and all is okay with that and my back is just something i'm going to have to live with so it's just the fact of learning how to manage the pain day to day um so the doctor told me I could finally get back on track with my workouts and stuff this summer. Um, and I was able to lose um, 12 pounds from mid-August to early September. So I was excited about that. And then um, she had me start doing keto and fasting. And six weeks of that, I was able to lose another almost 22 pounds. Um... I had lost, um, in, well, last spring before I got the back issues and stuff starting, I was actually down 250 pounds without weight loss surgery and just working my butt off for eight, eight and a half years and wrestling school and a whole bunch of other stuff. And then that popped up and I was stress eating a lot and dealing with physical therapy and everything for about a year because I wasn't able to work out and I gained 40 pounds back but now I'm just glad to be back on track and dealing with all the stuff I'm dealing with now so that's exciting um I have about 80 or so more pounds to my goal weight um so I'm hoping to reach that by next summer when I go see her again so I've just been dealing with all that stuff. So, um, like say, I've, I've been dealing with getting back on track with that as well as um, playing new video games that I have and just enjoying everything. So, um, anyway... So I'm trying to get back on track on making some more coloring videos and such too. I know some spots here I went over the line a little bit, but um, this will be okay because I plan on doing the background darker so it will cover up some of that uh, bleed so it's not a big deal. I just have to be very careful around the eyes and stuff because since that's going to stay white, uh, white gel pen sometimes with these purples and reds will not cover them up that well um so yeah but i was just trying to do a little bit of a shadow there um to make it more realistic this book is the 100 page cute animal book by jade summer uh, I would show you the cover, but right now I can't because I'm in the middle of doing this. Since it's a big open area, once you start, you don't want to stop. Um, because you'll get streaks. Um, as far as the shading and stuff goes, it won't be so bad. Um because it's still pretty wet. That's why I'm trying to do this quickly. So this is what I'm talking about when you gotta be quick when you do stuff like this and because it's such a close, not so close, but a very similar close color, 
I don't use to need the uh, excuse me I don't e need to use the blending tool um, just because it will work out just fine as far as these colors go um, the only time you really need to use the blending tool is when you're doing something far out as far as colors like a pink and orange or a, a teal and blue or something crazy um, which I can always get into in another video um, but I'm okay with it looking the way it does because once it starts to dry it'll look more of a shadow than anything um, but yeah so that's why I haven't been getting uh, some videos here for a little bit um, I did just order um, like I needed it but uh, a 320 set of um, a Hulu markers uh, because I noticed a lot of my browns like the E's and some of the R's um, are getting low on my backup supply um, so um, I just went ahead and bit the bullet and ordered a 320 set uh, even though I have probably over a thousand markers already it's just when you want certain backups and they don't have them in the single markers you have to order a big set um, so yeah but that was basically my birthday present to myself from my husband because he told me to get whatever I wanted um, so I ended up doing that and it turns out I am about a thousand points shy of their next rank of rewards which with the next rank will I'll be legendary and I will get a hundred dollar gift card and a hundred dollar um, off coupon I won't be able to use them together but um, I do want to thank I don't know who um, it was obviously but um, when I've been handing out my 10% um, off refer a friend code, when you buy a certain amount in markers, um, I get a $10 gift card. And four people that I referred a friend to with uh, recently, I was able to collect a $40 gift card in total. And I actually used that towards my 320 set I just ordered. So I want to thank whoever you were, uh, those four people. So that way I was able to order some more markers and hopefully be able to do more of these videos for you guys. Um, so it's helpful. So because I do enjoy doing these videos and... I do apologize. I've been playing my video games. But um, I have been coloring on the nights. I'm not playing my video games. I just haven't been doing videos because uh, my husband and I have been watching movies and TV shows instead. And on nights like this when he's down in our library downstairs, because it's like our library game room, because uh, he's reading, uh, I can do a video for you guys. Because um, I know he won't come barging upstairs if I tell him that I'm doing this. Because I actually like having it quiet unless I'm playing music like I have in other videos. But... I just have to be careful when I'm doing videos because apparently my camera doesn't like recording over 18 something minutes long, which I don't understand, but I can never figure out as far as how to make longer videos. Maybe it's just the quality. I don't know because I'm doing high definition quality. I don't know, but I figure I just see about finish 
finishing coloring some of this kitty cat while doing this for you guys. But this book, if you are in the Jade Summer group or the All Coloring group, All Skills Welcome on Facebook, I've been posting a lot of pictures I've finished from this book um, over the last... Oh, it's been two weeks, I think, since I started this book. And I've gotten, oh, I want to say 26 pictures done. 27. Uh, over the last two weeks, I do spend a lot of my days when I'm not playing video games or doing my exercise stuff or anything. I'm usually coloring um, unless I have friends over or um, I'm spending time with my husband uh, going to concerts or whatever so our last concert we went to was Great White and Slaughter uh, last month so that was fun I ended up taking one of my best friends with us and another friend of ours went and saw Iron Maiden and brought me back a t-shirt. That was so awesome of her. Because she actually had to drive a little ways to get to that concert. And there was no way we were going to be able to go. So she brought us back a shirt. So. As you can see, I'm trying to avoid the... The parts I just colored with my hand because, again, the oils will actually make it discolor. So, and I don't want that. I was planning on doing the little fur patch in the front and stuff. Uh, a lighter purple, but I actually think I'm going to do it black well kind of black nice thing about the 320 set it's got so many shades of black and grays so um, we are going to do that and this is a, a lighter gray you'll see as it starts to dry it's a little bit lighter. But let me see where I'm at time wise. Okay, we just hit 13 minutes. So I'm going to have to wrap this up here soon. Again, this is where I talk about how to start dark to light and stuff like that. But if you get used to coloring with these markers like I am, you can sometimes get away with coloring just in any order. Uh, you just have to be extra careful. So... You just have to make sure what you're working with is fully dry before you start adding other colors and doing other crazy things. Because um, if you don't, it definitely can bleed over fairly easy and cause smudging. But if you guys have any questions, I'm no expert. I'm just posting these videos from what I've learned over using these markers the last two and a half years. Um, I started watching videos um, on YouTube on how to use them and just a bunch of trial and error uh, over the years uh, using them because I know when I first started using them looking at some of the pictures I had done when I first started using them I know I said first using them a lot 
Um, a lot of, I had a lot of bleed and a lot of, uh, different things to actually, uh, try to get used to working with them and stuff. So, and to everybody that has thanked me for these videos, uh, you're very welcome. So, I hope to do more soon. Um, but... I think this one for tonight, I am going to stop here because I am creeping up on 16 minutes and I don't want my camera to cut off. Um, I might just pause this as far as uh, coloring this image goes and maybe get back to it another day with a part two and do it. Uh, just so you guys can see me color it some more. Either that or I might do it now. I don't know. We'll see. We will see. So, let me finish this. Plus, I don't know when my battery is going to need to be charged on this camera either. Because I did do um, a keto fasting update video earlier for my Facebook profile. Um, so, yeah. Alright, let me see if I can get this other ear tuft done. But you can see, whoop, you can see how that, um, purple is drying. And how it looks, like, a little bit shadowed there. But, anyway, I am going to get off of here and maybe do another video on the continuation of this or I might just do it another day I might finish the cat and start another video at another another excuse me another time for the rest like the tree and the vase and all that kind of stuff so thanks for watching everybody I hope everyone is doing well and I will see you in the next video